Hello friends, welcome back to the new video of React Native. So today we are going to learn about the React Native SDK that is GIF SDK. So this package is basically used to pull down the GIF from their API into your React Native app. So let's start. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like it and share and comment on it. Okay, so let's get started. So this is the package that we need to install into your React Native app. Just copy it and install into your app, right? <clears throat> After installing this package, let me add this package. So I'm going to add this package right now. Before, meanwhile, we can connect to the AnyDesk at the same moment also. So here we go with the AnyDesk. So this is the AnyDesk. Cancel. This is the AnyDesk. Okay, so AnyDesk is installed. Oh, sorry, connected. So let's, it's done. What happened here? No, it's added. Okay, so let's uh, uh, run this app. So this is the app that we have to run. Okay, after installing this, this is the code that we have to use. So you can see that. So here we have used the React, use state, use effect and from the React, right? And this is the export default function. And this is the uh, where it is. This is the uh, conf this one. And here we have just calling the REST API of that one. If you render random from the key. Okay. After doing this, this is the fetch API call. I have... Uh, you can also check the packet.json where we have added. Let me give you the clue of that. For, uh, where is packet.json? I think I have used the fetch API of the Jiffy also. Packet.json. So this is Jiffy JS fetch API also I have used. And React Native SDF, Jiffy. These two things added for the this uh, to pull down the GIF from the, your API and the React Native SDK to show that part. Okay, so I have used both of them. So here you can see that in the fetch one, we have called this API. Whatever data we are getting from the image URL, the first response. Okay, so whatever the response we are getting from this one, so we are just passing the key to, to you need to create this key from the Jiffy. So let me go to that one also to create that key. So here we have the where we have to create the keys. Give me a second. Let's go to the requirements. So Jiffy developer portal, you need to go. So here you can see that there is an API Explorer. You need to log in. Log in with Facebook or something. You can log in. I need to log in using my Facebook auth. Continue. So you can here you can choose the app key. Choose an app or API key. So here you can go with this one. So you will get the request callback. Choose the endpoint. Whether you are random, I get up IDs by comma separated, search, translate, trending, random. So you can add it. You can see that here what we have used. Let me show you. So here we can see random. Here we have whatever random uh, one of one EGIF is going to be loaded into our app. So I will show you also. I have already done this. Okay, give me a second. Oh, where we go with this one. So here you can see that. Where is uh, this one? So it's loading. So you can see that whenever I used to just uh, shake this app and reload this one again. So you can see that the new image will come. So random. 
you can see that random uh, gif is gonna be taken place over here so i have used the random uh, gifs you can see that the key so here we go with this one you can choose the app or you can you have to create first the app first you need to create the app over here so sdk or the api okay recommended enter your app name uh, Rajni Khan, you can make the my name is Rajni Khan, so I'm going to use this part right by changing list. Create the app, app is created, and your API key is ready. Okay, use this API key, and uh, whenever you want to go, you can use it. Okay, and here we API key explorer. This is the app that we have. Choose a public API, and all of this we have already ready. If you want to make the endpoints, you can search, translate, trending, random, get by ID, get IDs by comma separated. All of these things you have to get it from this API. So you can make a nice, beautiful gallery, or you can say GIF <coughs> gallery over here. So uh, on the basis of the ID search criteria or something, you can make it and make a nice look of the GIF here, like the simply one, see, uh, like this one. In the demo, they have shown like search if we and by default you were setting the four or five random gifs and search that uh, all of this thing right so this is how you can make it very easily so the same thing this scenario i have used you have whatever you can just pass the search api or random something so whatever you can search from here you can pass it over here and you can use the api call over here and set the state after setting the state whatever the image you are getting on just put it here and show into your react native app so any doubt, any query in that, let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.